hello and welcome back to Tales of Arise. I haven't been here for like a week, um, which is sad because I wanted to be. It's just uh, hard sometimes to do things, you know? All right, let's get on. Let's see what's in here. Um, still a little sick. Not as sick because it's been a week, you know. Um, so last time, okay, so do a quick recap for myself and you. Um, last time we, um, found out about Zephyr and his son. Zephyr and his son, who is, who has joined the fascist movement, apparently. The, uh, these people here. Uh, oh, look, Hoodle's here! Oh, wait, Hoodle. One of your pals, Hoodle? Wait, where? Where, Hoodle? Hoodle. Why is there a thing here? Um, and yeah, and then, um, and we learned that, uh, Runwell has powers, um, and is a mage, and is a mage who can use magic, astral arts, um, which made... Um, Shion. Um, really suspicious. You sense one of your pals, Hoodle? Where, Hoodle? <clears throat> uh, here? Oh, I don't. Okay. Really confused about what this icon wants from me. Um, quite unclear to me, personally. Um, <clears throat> is it. Okay, so I'm gonna do this one more time. Okay, so now we're inside. Now it's sitting outside. Oh. Let's watch this. Is that owl okay? It's been stiff as a board for a while now. You're right. I wonder what's up with it. Come here. It's okay. I won't hurt you. <laughs> Crap! Huh? What happened? I hate to say this, Renwell, but I lost Hoodle. I didn't mean to scare him, but he took off. Hoodle? He's right next to you. He is? All I see is snow. Dan and owls conceal themselves when they feel threatened. I guess he's still not quite used to being around other people yet. That would explain it. I should have been more careful with him. Sorry. It's fine. I'm the only human he's comfortable with. Come here, Hoodle! Oh. Damn, he was that close? He's just a little wary of you. I think he gets that you're going to be with us for a while, though. Step in the right direction. If you call his name, he might eventually respond at least. Got it. Thanks. Oh, at least Hoodle. he's not sick or something. Indeed. It's quite a relief. Hmm. <laughs> oh, another one. Enemies who can cast astral arts can be pretty difficult. Not only are they powerful, but their range lets them strike us before we even get close. Actually, I can just disrupt astral arts. What do you mean? When someone is casting an art, their focus has to be entirely on the incantation. So right when they're completing the casting, I just kind of steal it from them. Oh. Then what do you do with the energy you've stolen? I hold on to it and use it whenever I want, like I can with my own magic. The thing is, I can only unleash that art once. After I use it, it's gone. Oh, also, when I steal astral energy, the enemy will lose focus, which means they can't cast anything else for a while. So not only can you steal their energy, but doing so incapacitates them too? That's amazing, Rinwell. I didn't realize your magic could do so much. It's actually something of a secret technique within my clan, so I kind of had to learn it. Well, if we come across any tough enemies that use incantations, I'm sure that power of yours will come in real handy. Yeah, it's tricky to pull off, but you can count on me. Nice. Cool. Okay. Um. 
Okay, was that it? Was that it for in here? <clears throat> Is there, like, there's not a button I can use to... Because I can't get up any higher. Okay, we're gonna try it again. Islands covered in perennial snow and racked by bitter cold. Now look at the door. I think Hoodle senses an owl around here. Just around here? Hmm. Wait, what is a... Uh, how the fuck do I get to the map? Uh, start? No. Wait, can I? Ah. Neighboring map. Wait, what? Chicken? Okay, Hoodle, I I would like to know where the owl is, buddy. Is that something we can do? Well, all right, let's try to remember how to fight. Cool. All right, we didn't lose too much health. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Recovery. Um. <clears throat> Okay. So, Hoodle says there's an owl around here somewhere. And we don't know how wide concept of here. For all my, um, arcade melody hands out there. Um,. How wide is our concept of here? I truly don't know. You see? Um. Hmm. Mm hmm. I simply don't want to miss any, you know? Like. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get this damn chicken in here. Apparently, that's in here. Okay, so it should be the far wall. All the way in there. Basket? Whoa. Hey, well, do you always have to say an incantation before you cast an art? Yeah. They don't really add any extra power or anything, but reciting them is what allows the astral energy to come together and flow through me. It takes time to complete, but they're what lets me use such strong magic in the first place. What happens if someone interrupts you while you're in the middle of chanting? Then I have to start over from the beginning. As soon as my concentration breaks, any astral energy I've accumulated disperses. Got it. So once you start reciting, that's our cue to make sure that no enemies can get near enough to disrupt you. Yeah, that would be appreciated. Although, I do have one fun trick up my sleeve. Once I finish chanting a full incantation, I can hold on to a single astral art without casting it right away. Oh. So once the astral energy's in place, you can choose to set it off whenever you want? That's amazing. Yeah, I don't fully have the hang of it just yet, but I'm sure it'll come in handy sooner or later. Um... Okay, well this does not resolve my chicken, you see? I guess it doesn't matter, but like... Oh wait, is that something? Okay, it should be like right here. What if I... Yeah, 
Damn, I was hoping it would give me like a secret spell or something I could use. Oops. Um, I'll probably change party leaders like genuinely later, but I'm currently not at that point, so that's okay. Okay. All right. You sense one of your pals, Hoodle? Hoodle, where, bud? Hoodle. Okay, so if I had, if I was hiding a Hoodle here, right to hide a Hoodle, right a Hoodle hidle, um, I would put it. Um, I don't know, like there or. I don't think I've missed any yet. Is the thing I want them all. <clears throat> oh no. You sent one of your pals nearby. Okay. Okay, so let's look in the map. What's nearby here? Here? What is what is this little outcropping? This? No, it isn't. Is this it? Is this the terminus of it? Hmm. Hmm hmm hmm. Sorry, I know this probably isn't compelling content, but I'm like so confused. I want the hoodle. I want the owl. Um, hmm. What's one of your friends nearby? Hmm. Oops. Little help. Take it. Here I go. It's over. You're mine. <laughs> Damn it, You're mine. Reload. Uh -huh. Damn it, Fang. Get in the way, way into the fray. <laughs> Field. <laughs> Damn it, Fang. Or for the front line. Damn it, Fang. Now. Here I go. You're mine. Here I go. Let's reload. Get in the way. Now back into the fray. Strike. Damn it, Fang. Wow. Okay, Runwell. Shit. I'm ready for the next battle. Fuck. See that shit she did? Oh my god. Um. <clears throat> okay. What the fuck? <laughs> I didn't realize it was gonna let me do that. Okay. Um, I'm gonna quick. Wait, where are we? What was this map called? White Silver Plains. Oops. Ooh. Um. I think I got, I think I have an answer. Oh shit, not this. Okay. This should be, ah oh, yeah. Uh oh. I have a bad feeling about this. Let the marksman handle this. Take it! Raging uh -huh. this game! Demon Fang! Through. You're mine! It's yeah. over! It's on! Damn Pick up flyers! Way. I've got feel! Let a marksman handle I'll be saving this one! All yours! You're on! More when I can Take run! Take it! Man, dance in the wind! Sleep now! Start I'll be saving this one! I never miss! You're mine! Do it! You're finished! Where would that came from? Still! 
This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Mega Ready, here I come! Huh? Friend! Friend. There. Nice. Onward and upward. This is where we're going. Um. Oh, okay, so this isn't white. No, okay. <laughs> there are, um... In prior games, there are some chests that look like stones, so I was like, hmm? <clears throat> what beast from the entrance to the side? I kind of want to. I kind of want to heal, but I don't want to deal with it. Oops! Oh shit! Brace yourselves. This one's tough. Here, it's over. Burn it. I'll give you a help one. Oh shit! Oh shit. Our work is done here. Let's move. Okay, okay. We'll get this fucking lettuce. Let's get this lettuce as they <laughs> Uh no. Okay. So does that hurt? No, okay. The animation Endura or the animation looked like it would hurt, so just making sure. A life bottle. Okay. Okay. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Um, hopefully there's a place to rest. If not, I can just fast travel. I just I forgot about fast travel just now, so it's fun. By the bridge. Be a great time to help me find out where the owl is, bud. <laughs> oh. Oh. An eye patch. Thanks, Owl. Looks like we've spotted one of Hoodle's friends. Okay, so that's that. It should have been ten. So I, I'm gonna look at my outfits real quick. Attachments. So I have frame glasses, monocle, left eye patch. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah, oh, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, no, eight. Okay, so I'm missing two. Okay. That's so funny. Ooh. Oh my god. Imagine, though. Oh! 
The monsters kind of suit her. Oh, the monocle's funny. Cat ears, cat ears. That's cute. But... You put no cigar, my brain said. Alright. We're oh, missing a couple owls. All right, real game time. It's eerily quiet. No sign of Zephyr. You think they took him away already? What say we quit hiding and go ask some villagers? Someone's bound to report us no matter what we do, so we might as well. Hey, Shion! What? You heard her. She's got a point. Our cover was blown last night. Where's the sense in sneaking around? And what if there are soldiers lurking about? They would have followed us to the cabin already. Relax. The coast is clear. Let's hurry and speak to the villagers. Is she always like that? I don't know how you managed to put up with her. What makes you think I'm managing? <laughs> Aww. To be fair, she is very prickly, but... Let's try talking to the villagers. Alright, what's up, man? What's up, bro? It's good. <sighs> oh, yep. You look real nervous, kid. You look real nervous, kid. What's the matter? Hmm. Hey. You're not thinking of turning someone in, are you? Or are you worried you're gonna be reported? <sighs> No, that's not it. And what's wrong? Hmm. The Zookles, they're... Mm -hmm. They're what? In the way and... Hmm. <sighs> He's gone quiet again. They're in the way and you were trying to do something outside the village. Yeah. But people aren't free to move around as they please. I'm not sure he's trying to do anything so dangerous. Unless he had a, unless he had a real good... Unless he had a real good reason for it, that is. Hmm. <sighs> he probably doesn't even want to talk to us since we're complete strangers. I don't think he's a bad kid, though. Yes. In that case, we have to do Great. something. All right, we'll take care of your Zoogle problem. Huh? We are? Sure we are. We're going to clear the Zoogles around this village. Whatever he's struggling to do, it can't be hard. It can't hurt to get rid of him for him, right? Yeah, I guess. Oh, it's okay. This is something we want to do. You don't have to tell us anything if you don't want. Fire beneath the ice. All right, let's get some Zoogs. Let's Zoog it up. Zoog it up, baby, now, twist and shout. Oh, zoog it up, baby, now, where's the door? Here's the door. I zoog left, right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Zoogin' time. Allow us to zoog. Oh. Zugan. That looks like Oops. the Zugal we were told about. That. <laughs> yeah, that's the guy. Uh, Artisi. Artisis. Well, okay, what is this? Uh, a wide swing that ends with a ground crush that sends rocks flying. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I'm kind of I'm kind of happy with what I got so far. We're just gonna we're gonna let that be for now. We're gonna fight these zoogs. <clears throat> we're gonna zoog them up, old style. Whoa. Level up. Google, we were asked to handle. I think I need seven. So it's these and two. Uh, two more. Dispose of the trap. Rising Wyvern! I'm on the wing! Mirage! Air thrust! Take it! Demon Fang! So 
Oops. Well, I needed those anyway. Actually, I do need those. I forgot. Oh, I don't know where to find it. Skill panel? Um, these. Boost attack downs 35. Weapon types forged. Those give me new titles, which get... Wait a minute. That should also be true for everyone else. Meals cooked. Okay. Accessories forged. And aerial enemies downed by boosted attacks. Okay, that's interesting. Um, arts casted stopped by boosted attacks. Curiosity. <clears throat> full of boundless... Full of boundless curiosity. Rinwell can't help but wonder where and when things are made. She examines the items she comes across in the world. Despite being damning, Rinwell manages... Rinwell comes from a clan of astral art wielding major. Secret she kept hidden until the time was right. Underblade. Let's give her more elements to work with, yeah. Um, these are more Zoogles? They are. Well, sir, uh, these appear to be Zoogles. A double demon thing to make the area more safe to travel in. Oh, right, yeah. We are riders on a mission. Action kitchen play position. Rocket power. Mm, I don't actually think it's called. I don't actually think that the rocket power theme song includes the word, uh, the words, um, action kitchen. But I don't remember what else it would be, and that's the thing I've always said, so... While knowing I'm wrong, I simply, um... Uh, don't know. <clears throat> Do you sense one of your friends, Hoodle? Messia224? Now that's a weird name. Messia is basically a code. It indicates it's a small village. So it's not its actual name? Then does that mean that 224 is... Yeah. It's merely a serial number assigned to it for administrative purposes. So the Renans even get to decide what places are called out in this realm. Mmm. Yep, hate that. Hey. We're back. We dug out as many Zoogles nearby as we could. That should hopefully make it a little safer to walk around oh. here. Till oh. next time. I don't know what you're trying to do, kid, but I hope everything works out for you. See ya. Oh, wait, wait. Mm. I don't get it. Why would you guys do something like that when there's nothing in it for you? Because I would have felt guilty if I did nothing. Only for one of those Zoogles to get you later, that's why. Huh? That's the only reason you fought those Zoogles? Even though there are snake eyes all over the place? I think making sure nobody dies is good enough reason to do just about anything, don't you? Wow. Alfin. That's a Tails protagonist for you. So, my friend Christine uh, just started today. Here, I'm gonna I'm gonna go up to their page here. <clears throat> I'm gonna go up to their uh, Twitter. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They said something that I thought was important. Um, yeah. Okay. Hold on. Um, they one of their tweets reads in their tweet in their Twitter thread about Tales of Arise. Man jumps in the way of a child about to be beaten by a big dude in armor. This is a Tales protagonist to me. Um, and they're right. The thing about Tales protagonists is that they are good. And the way good is defined is something that, that, something that the games are interested in complicating, something that the games are interested in finding um, ways to both undermine and reaffirm um, in ways that I think are super interesting. That's one of the things I love about this game is that, like, it, or about these games that I've seen so far, um, is that 
they throw in things that are complicated. They throw in things that are not just like, um, so, you know, you have, you have a linear path in the story, right? A to B. Um, and it, and usually it's just this plot line. These are the, these are the correct things. These are, these are my, this is correct. This is correct. This is correct. Um, but the, the way the game like creates this, uh, the ambiguity and creates like a space wherein other answers can be correct. But for this character that answers, this is their correct answer. And, um, yeah, it just really complicates it in a way that like, I think a lot of, at least like Tumblr, <laughs> Tumblr, um, criticism for media, um, uh, often fails to, um, appreciate and, um, and fully factor in, um, is the, the sorts of places where in a character might not have the right answer, might not have like the, the fully ethical, like the, the ethical win for the answer necessarily. They're not like a, okay, well they've, they've, they processed the emotional calculus of, of all of these decisions and they've created the, the one that is the most numerically perfect and if you were to assign a point system to it i think that's really i just think it's good i think it's good that how interested they are in doing that on your way here did you guys happen to come across a guy who runs a general store inside a cabin yes actually now that you mention it yeah did you need something from him there's someone i want to marry huh oh oh you wanted to visit the shop to have him make one of those things huh you know what he's talking about of course People in uh, Cislodia used to give these special owl charms to their loved ones as a sign of how they feel. It really, it's a really, really old tradition. I don't think anyone else even knew about it these days. <laughs> That's right. I know it sounds weird, but Cislodia the way, I know it sounds weird, but with Cislodia the way it is, I thought it was really important for me to make the effort. That's so good. That's such a, yeah. <laughs> Times being what they are. It's not weird. I think it's really beautiful. Wait, back up a minute. If you just needed to go to the general store, doesn't this village have one too? The guy who runs the one in the cabin is a friend I grew up with. This charm is really important to me, so I want him to be the one who makes of it. Of course. Now I understand. Sounds like all that Zoogle hunting we did paid off then. Otherwise, I would never have had the opportunity to learn about such a special tradition here. <laughs> Thank you guys for everything you've done. I'll never forget it. Hmm. Good. <clears throat> Love that for you. Okie dokie. Um, uh, another quest. Don't see anybody here. around here who could use our help? We can't chase after every little thing. No, we're going to, Shion. Sorry. Huh? Huh? You folks look mighty suspect to me. I can tell just by looking at you that you're not from around here. Normally, I'd report you to the Bureau, and that'd be that. Hey. Look, we don't want to cause any kind of trouble. Is there any way we can convince you to keep quiet about this? Well, the Bureau likes to reward people who report folks. What are you willing to offer me? Uh, Excuse sure. me? We don't have to give you anything, but there are plenty of other ways to keep people quiet. Easy, Shin. <sighs> easy. You're the one who's Sorry. easy. Mm. All right. What do you want? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Oh, uh, that made me laugh so hard I had a coughing fit. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, now let me see. I know. I could use some food. How about you bring me some fruits and vegetables? <laughs> I don't mean the wilted stuff that grows here. I'm talking about the fresh, wild stuff that grows outside. And over less and apples. How's this? How's this? Is this enough for you? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Spotlucker. This motherfucker goes, Yeah! Okay. Oh, you've got food for me, huh? Well, come on, hurry up and hand it over. Will you promise to keep quiet about us now? <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah, yeah, I won't tell anyone, I swear. You, uh, you can count on me. Mm. Nothing smells fishy about all this. Why were you so insistent on these coming from the outside village? You can grow them here. 
I told you, the wild stuff's a lot fresher. The soil here is practically worthless. The problem is we're forbidden from just leaving the village whenever we like. Even worse, there are all these zoo ghouls crawling around outside. <sighs> you made us stick our necks out for you instead. Did you enjoy the swell guy? Enjoy your food, uh. I guess. What? Who said anything about eating this stuff? Don't be stupid. That's not what I'm going to do with all this. Oh, he's going to sell it. <laughs> I plan on selling it all, obviously. Do you know how much demand there is for fresh food like this around here? Just great. Right. No, it's still dirty. Just for all this guy. <sighs> this realm's definitely got a lot of problems to work through still. They reacted just like we expected. Yeah. Do you think we'd end up like that if we had to treat everyone with suspicion? It's like the bitter cold has frozen the hearts of those who live here. Well, that's poetic. Hmm. The bitter cold has frozen. I think there's someone in trouble here. Well, let's see what they have to say. Um... What is this? Oh, it's main quest stuff. Right. A cow? Hi. Oh, you got me the milk? Thanks, buddy. A little cow. Okay. Okay. Okay, alright. Whoa, we're, we're hootling. We're hootling and hollering. Hoodle. Hoodle, where? Hoodle. Uh, okay, okay, Hoodle. I'm, I'm trying to help you find your friend, bud. Okay, so, okay. If it's below? Okay, let's go, let's go below. Let's go below. Yeah, I think upwards is the, is the, um, the critical path. So if I'm gonna guess, it would be this way. Oh. Um. Stay calm. We don't know where oh. they took Zephyr yet. Oh, okay. Well, I was wrong. Sometimes, dear viewer of mine, I am wrong. Uh, possible. Possible and oftentimes probable, you see. Oh. oh. Chicken! I have acquired uh, the chicken. Melina. Okay. Hoodle. Alright, Hoodle. Let's, let's, let's simmer down now, Hoodle. Alright, Hoodle. Let's see. Oh, hoo hoo. Yep. Okay. Hoodle, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't. I don't know where. I don't know where. Oh, oh wait, what? What's that? Woohoo! 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 Oh? Woohoo! Wait, where? Oh! Oh, good job, Hoodle. Honestly, good job, Hoodle. Looks like we've spotted one of Hoodle's friends. Hold on, everyone. Everyone, please give it. Please, please, let's let's just give a round of applause to Hoodle real quick. I think Hoodle deserves that one. Um, let's just all let's all just good job, Hoodle. We love you. All right. Um. Wolfiers. Is that what I got? Oot foots. Oh, that's cute though. Look at him. He's looking at him. He's like a little wolf man. I think that's I think that's apt, but also we're not I'm not there yet. We are still on hour seven. Oh my god. Yeah. Hey buddy, uh, this is not too much to ask. You think you could spare some silicon? Silicon. Brinwell. Brinwell, do you have an idea of what this man's talking about? Yeah. I think he's talking about I think he's talking about alcohol. Of course alcohol. No. Of course, alcohol. What'd you think I meant? Hold on. You folks aren't from around here, are you? <laughs> if you were, I'd get the hell out of here before someone reports you. How are you? This guy sure changed his tune fast. I can't really blame him. People here are doubting even their own neighbors, much less strangers like us. Hey, uh, let me ask you something. Why do you need the Silgen stuff for anyway? What? Whether the bright eyes are running around the show or not, I've still got to put food on the table uh. somehow. Without some silicon, I'll freeze to death working out here in this cold. I guess. Not just a buzz you're after. You want to stave off the cold. Unfortunately, we don't have any silicon on us. Is there anyone else? Any? Oh, anything else we can yeah. maybe do? Yeah, we don't want to ask for anything in return. We just want to yeah. help. You mean that? In that case, could you grab me the ingredients to brew it? 
You can find what I you can find what you, what I need from Zoogles. I didn't realize you can make Zoogle parts. I can. I didn't even realize you could use Zoogle parts to make booze. People sure are creative. Yeah, we'll go hunting for it. We don't have what you need, but you think you can hang on here? I want to find it. What? Not like I got much of a choice. But you sure you want to help? Let's be crossing paths with Zoogles, you know. I can't not do anything when you're in need. I feel guilty just leaving you in a creek, up a creek. Uh, I'll take fighting a couple dozen Zoogles over a couple of a couple of Zoogles. I totally just added dozen. That's not that appears nowhere in there. Uh, over trying to plow the dirt here in this sort of climate any day of the week. <sighs> Hard liquor. Okie dokie. How many Zoogles we gotta fight? Oh, we don't need to fight. We don't need to. It's not a number. To make drinks. That takes guts. No one would have come up with it before the occupation. <clears throat> that's for sure. You don't think the snake eyes will hold it against them, do you? If anything, the warmth might help loosen them up. Ooh. That's nice. Okay, I, uh, I need to know. I need to know my items. Um, Chamomile. Wait, are these one time uses? Or that raises different. Um, wait, what is it? Endurance. Defense, endurance. What is endurance? What is endurance in the context of this game? Um. Penetration. Well, definitely defense. Okay, anyway, that's not, that's not what I'm here for. I'm looking for it's seed, I think, or something. Earth seed. Yeah, I have I have three. Okay. Okie dokie. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Listeners, readers, I am. Um, Oh, by the time you re by the time you hear this, I will have finished the book. But I have um, I've been going to the library and I have like a ton of books, right? I have well, I have seven books that I'll, I will have checked out um, when I go to the library again. I have four on hold and I have three in hand. Um, and um, but an October Day book just came out, and I you know I can't not read those. Um, I'm like on the it's like the fourteenth book or something. Um, Anyway, yeah, I'm just like, I'm just like, well, I'm gonna have to read that. I can't just not read it, especially because I have like um, two people I care about who I want to talk to about it. And you know, you can't talk to people about stuff unless they've read it. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm just like, okay, well, I guess I'm gonna do this. Um, so yeah, I um, I wanted to record like a bunch of videos today, but I'm probably gonna do two or three and then hop out. Unclear. Um, here we go. But yeah, if you see when you see my when you see my shirt color change, that's, that's a new video. Oh, that's a new recording day. Rip. Our work is done here. Sharp thing. I'm right behind you, Shion. Right behind you, Shion. Right behind you. This won't be easy. Don't be such a pessimist. Pierce through! Demon Tank! You're mine! You're finished! You're on! One more! That 
that was cool shit. No complaints here. <clears throat> God, I think I've only been pressing Alphans. I think I just realized right now that there are fuck off. Oh, that there are other kinds. I won't forgive you. Rising Here I come. In here. You're finished. I'll be safe. You're on. Here I come. I'm, uh, I'm uh, so good with Air Force cards. It. It's over. You got flyers. I'm not good. Let a marksman handle it. Pierce through. All yours. You're finished! You're mine! It's over! Rising Wyvern! You're mine! It's over! Reload! In here! Here I come! Reload! I'm out here! Here I come! Still! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! Okay, so Shion's and Alphans are both that. But Alphans can be... Okay. Looks so like there's maybe more options than that. It's cool. Gotta break through. Pierce through. Here I come. Strata. Take this. Mirage. If it's in the You're mine. You're finished. I'm out. I'm all stuck. Take this. Ignite. Lightning the dead. Here's a healing arc. Rising wipers. First aid. Thanks. Seems about right to me. Hard bone. Not even the thing. Wow. I won't forgive you. Raging cascade. Burning. Well, any injuries? Ouch. Um, so Matazoogs, we are missing some Zoogies. Um, maybe it's like Dark Souls, though. I know I've compared this. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> I know I've compared this game to Dark Souls previously, but this is different. Or, it's not the same argument. Can't believe I'm <clears throat> camping with a Renin of all people. Shion saved my hide before. You can trust her. But... Cold mushrooms. Um... Oh, yes. Can I change who cooks the food? Wait, does she have to cook the meals? Oh fuck, I don't know how many there were before. Um, huh? let's take the... Skill panel... What do I have? I have 800. Oh, almost. Um... Yeah. Oh! That's probably useful, right? I think she uses those too. Ailment rate, toxicity, heart casting resilience, nerve blast. I think I'm doing that. Accessories. Meals cooked. Uh, okay, I'm gonna say that that's eight. And I'm gonna say that, or I'm gonna see. Uh, acht. That's my favorite number in German because of the. Ugh. Um, well, it was my favorite number in German. I don't technically currently have a favorite number anymore, but at the time it was a favorite to my. Okay, cool. I did respond then. No choice. Take it. Ah! 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 It's over. Demon Prince, Rising Wyvern, you're mine. It's over. Rising Wyvern! I'm not done! Rising 
Nicely done. Sharp fang, hard bones. Well, that is more stuff. We are getting more stuff indeed. Please. Simple. Brace yourselves. This one's tough. There. And again. Here I come. Demon fang. It's on. Take this. It's over. Come on. It's over. Here I come. Rising Wyvern! Here I come! You're mine! Here I come! It's over! You're mine! Pretty good. It's about right to me. I s do we truly not have one yet? What was it again? Oh, no, it would have been Earth Seed. We still only have. Wait. What is the little number? What is the four and the two? Hmm. Well, we don't have any yet. We haven't gotten. We don't have. We, none of those numbers are four, so. It's a moot point. I won't forgive you! Here I come! It's over! Here's the Here I come! Win. Barely a blip on our radar. Am I getting the right zoogles? Am I, am I fighting the right zoogles? <clears throat> Activity records. Four earth seeds. Okay. Okay, we're gonna. Uh, we're gonna Google the zoogle. Um. Earth scenes from Roper enemies. Oh shit! Yes, I am fighting the wrong Zoogles. By the way, it's a good thing I find out. I I learned though. That's good. Um. Okay, so slow ya. Uh, what was it called again? The Ulven Grotto? Um... Where's the teleport point? Is there one? No. Oh, there's this fast travel point. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Well, we still have... We're still high on the, um... Um, the cooking. What if you can fast travel from inside here? Ah, oh, shit. Is the blazing sword okay? A little water's not going to hurt it. Hmm. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Okay. Don't 
Don't get careless. Don't tell me. I get it. That's the um. Rising Wyvern! Do it! Astral energy! There we go. Extend gate. Look at this shit. Fucking cool as hell. We've got the ingredients. Let's okay. get them back to Messia. Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. We're still not high enough level for that, probably. Um you know, yeah, I was just thinking about the Zoogle, that big Zoogle, that's level, like, fucking 40. I was like, oh, okay, I can get this. It'll just be, like, once I'm leaving this area for good. No, they want me to come back there, like, mid-game, uh, which is probably true of the Zoogle here, uh, which is why I'm not bothering. Also, I just don't want to be sad about it, so. Ah, uh, yeah, that's where we are. Okay. Oh, we can fast travel there. Hell yeah. back is everything you need to brute syllogen right yeah yeah it sure is you really don't mind if i have these we told you we just want to help so go on take it we won't stop okay. you okay well, all right although i had to ask what the hell do you brew alcohol how the hell do you brew yeah. alcohol with this stuff technically you can just bite into it as is but no one's stupid enough to waste a bunch of good ingredients doing that what you got to do is pack in snow and let it sit by a fireplace for a week and then once you distilled all that melted snow, pow, silicon. But you gotta be careful. Silicon is so strong, it'll start a fire if you don't handle it with care. Ow. Ah, that makes me want to try a little. Not until you're the right age, Ridwell. I know, you don't have to remind me. Like I said, though, there's no way I can work outdoors without this stuff. <laughs> so, thanks. It's nice to see there's still some good folks in this world. Uh, disclaimer, uh, alcohol does not, in fact, increase your heat tolerance. It only, um, it only keeps you from feeling it. It makes your body feel cold, or feel warm. It doesn't actually, uh, perform the functions that actual heat will. Um, and, in, <clears throat> and thus, um, and thus makes it dangerous, uh, for you to be in cold. Um, most of the time it probably won't matter. Most of the time it's like, oh, I'm just, you know, I'm drinking some alcohol while I'm, like, going on a walk and, like, I don't know. 40 degrees or 50 degrees, something like that, but 40 Fahrenheit, but, you know, just, you know, just to be sure I'm saying it out loud, okay, a dish, no, that's not it, this one, a vegetable and salmon soup boiled in milk, the meat and vegetables, the meat and vegetables linger together inside of a milk broth, hmm, oh, cool. all right, um, yeah, I think we're going to leave it there for today, or for this episode. Um, okay. Yeah, we're going to leave it there. Um, oh, excuse me. Okay. Whoa. Um, thanks for joining me. As always, you can find me on Twitter at Windjama. You can find the actual played podcast I, co I co-host on Twitter at Comrades with a Q or Comrades.com, also with a Q. You can find the actual pod play podcast I'm in on Twitter at AppapPod, A-A-P-A-P-A-P-Pod. And as always, you can find me here at TheHereticRoad.com, and I will see you next time. Bye! Mm -hmm.